tell me when. I, I'm it's killing me. It's killing me. You look so good. This is so. Uh... Oh no! <laughs> Thank you so much. I love you. We're having the best life. Ever. It's been a long-awaited wedding, given the past year, and we're so happy that we can finally all be here. You two just seem to complement each other. Allie, we are so happy to have you in our family. You were delightful to be around. Laughter is never far from your lips. My mom recently told me that when your mom was pregnant with you, she prayed and prayed for a happy baby. It was what she wanted most for you, and that's exactly what she got. There is no doubt in my mind that your mom handpicked Jesse for you. And Jesse, you're very lucky because life will, Al, will never be boring. <laughs> Ali, I think you are marrying the most loyal, caring, generous person I've ever met. And I know that you guys are going to have a blessed and happy marriage. And I'm just an honor to be both of your friends for now and years to come. So I love you guys so much. Congratulations. We made it. Let me take a moment to talk a little bit about how we got here, and that's not like the journey to Nantucket, the journey of Allison and, and Jesse. We'll go back to 2017, and I was lucky enough to have one of those father-daughter moments where the daughter actually wants to listen, is looking for some thoughtful feedback, but she starts telling me about this new boyfriend, Jesse. And um, we're talking about it, and then she just launches into this real full-blown assessment of what she thinks of Jesse. Allison is one of these people that says, I'm good by myself. I can make it through life by myself. So then she comes around to say, I think I could marry this guy, right? And then goes from there to simply say, in fact, I think I'm going to marry this guy. <laughs> So when, when her mother passed away, she left a note. And I'm going to take a moment and uh, try to read it for you. And she said, as for finding a husband, that is the one thing I don't think you will ever have to worry about. Just make sure you find one that you love and that respects and honors you for the wonderful self you are. And so I think you succeeded, and I know she'd be proud of you. So. We went on a, like our second or third date. We were out at Pizza Beach, and um, Bruce Springsteen's song "Born to Run" came on, and that was like my mom's favorite song, and that was what we had played at her wake. And I that that was something that I shared with him that I usually didn't share with people. He grabbed my hand on the table and just held my hand for the entire length of the song. And then looked at me and was like, I promise, like, I'm, I'll do anything to make sure nothing ever hurts you again. When I first saw Allie, in my memory, it's like, it's like a new page in my memory of a whole, whole new book begins. Like it's, and it reads, here begins a new life. We all know Jesse and Al know how to throw a great party, and tonight is certainly no different. So let's have ourselves an amazing night. Congrats to both of you.
If as we're walking, a hand should slip free, I'll wait for you, and should I fall behind, wait for me.